It looks like a peaceful day in the Tikab Valley, a lush district of Kapisa province, southwest of the capital of Kabul. But in recent years, the valley, once known mainly for its pomegranates, has become a hotbed of insurgent activity. In 2011, it became one of 43 districts selected to implement the Afghan Local Police, or ALP. An initiative of the American General David Petraeus, the ALP were created to support local forces in defense of their own villages. Its members are supposed to be nominated by the community and have the advantage of knowing the local situation and people. To learn more about the ALP and their role in Tagab, I visited the valley as a guest of Abdul Safi, the commander of the 210-member ALP unit there. <laughs> The ALP received training, weapons, and a salary from the U.S. Special Forces, but their activity is limited to their village, and they are required to report to a national police chief. میتونه دبی صاحب کردی پیر جوانی را که شما ایجا میبینی شما از یا پرسان کنی که شما زندگی تا نالی چرا قم پیش میبری نه مرمی توب سرشان میان نه صدای فرد گوشان میان آرام زندگی خدا نمیکنن سر کشاورزی خود میرن کسی سر کار خود میرن تلفات دادن و که زخمی دادن شهی دادن اما امنیت آوردن گول الام از ده هر اوه تگاه بلیج کانسل هی از پلیزد و ده ایل پی Yet despite the insistence that the ALP have secured Tagab, much of the valley remains plagued by violence. Here, in front of a national police outpost, is a Taliban graveyard. And just across lies a village under control of insurgents. The outpost takes sniper fire on an almost daily basis, and Commander Safi warned me to finish filming quickly. And there's yet another side to the story of the Afghan local police. A recent report by Human Rights Watch accused the ALP of committing extortion, rape, and murder. Commander Safi dismisses the criticism. کسایی که مخالفین دولت هستن ما به هیچ عنوان از کارمند دولت راضی نیستن این خوب بلو پولیس محلیست که سلا پیشش هست از کارمندی که قلم در دستش هست او از او خوش نمی آید یک دوار یک Because of the security situation I wasn't able to walk around freely and ask locals about their thoughts on the ALP So when I returned to Kabul I met with Dr. Hamid a native of Kapisa with many relatives that still live in Tagab. Dr. Hamid understands why the ALP are criticized. He's more concerned, however, about what will happen to the police force when ISAF retreats.
نگران هستم از آینده از اینا و به نظر من فردا شاید فردای روشنی نخواهد بود